Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome back to the channel. I'm David Carroll, your Las Vegas realtor with Signature Real Estate Group, and welcome to Corbett Ranch by Summit Homes. Have a look around. It's a beautiful day here in the Northwest, eight mile an hour winds. We're 2,481 feet above sea level. This is one of their model homes. They have lot number one, quick move in, ready to go. They got lot number two, spec, quick move in, ready to go. And this is the one we're gonna to be touring today. Now we have a total of nine home sites here. We got two quick move-ins. We have three more builder specs coming up that have been permitted. And then a couple more dirt lots available. We got home sites range from about 12,500 up to about 17,000 square feet. Now this is home site two. It's model 3756, but the way it's set up, it's currently about 3,500 square feet. They did add on the three car garage, which kind of deletes one of the flex space options. Now this is a four bedroom, three bath, priced at $910,565. They do have incentives to buy down that rate and give me a call. They are taking offers. Let's take a look around the side. I love these homes. You got the RV gate, you got room to, to move around. 200 amp panel, communications, gas meter, water, backflow, preventer. They also have the TX pest control. This is where the air conditioners will be housed. Let's take a quick peek in the back. You can hear the birds chirping. Currently 81 degrees, 52 on the air quality here in Las Vegas. And wow, now you can really see the depth of this backyard single story ranch my favorite stunning got a nice full length patio cover got the slider off of this room triple glass stacking slider i do like the cute coach lighting for sure pretty good run again the runs go pretty far up on these homes i can appreciate it Now, if you're building from dirt, it is about a six month build time from dirt. Lot premiums are anywhere from about 15 to 20,000, I believe, or 10 to 20. Looks like they're just doing the finishing touches on this home, cleaning up the stucco. It is all skip trawl stucco texture. So the 3756, four bedrooms, great room, game room, flex room, three baths, three to four car garage, beautiful stone. They have two exteriors they're using out here for the elevations, for the different stone work. And that is definitely an eight-foot garage door. Here's your entryway. Two coach lights. I like it. Almost enclosed little porch area. It's the little things. You can really just decorate this and bring it to life. Now you've got the double doors, eight-foot doors. Let's take a closer look. Welcome inside. This one is quick moving. No furniture, not modeled. Looks like nine by four feet almost, nine inches. Very nice plank. I always love luxury vinyl plank. I'm really into the wood nowadays though, but it's too expensive for me. Almost four inch on the base, orange peel smackdown texture. And then it's taking a step back. Here's from that corner vantage point. So you have your living room, your great room, dining room, kitchen. On this side of the house, you have, looks like secondaries. Now let's take a closer look. Six LEDs and a pre-wire over your great room. The triple glass stacking slider is magnificent not only to see out, but to let all that light in. Here's our slider. Let's see how it slides. I've always loved their sliders here. It makes a difference. So smooth. Now here's the dining. Four LEDs, no pendant pre-wire. You have the game room here. Quite a bit of room in this house. Be great for a family, sprawl out. I do
do see pre-wires for one and one coax cable on the floor there. Looks like a level three, level four granite, double stacked on the edge. Sterling undermount, Moen hardware. I tell you what, I really like the feel of this kitchen. Let me back it up. Coming around this corner, so much room again, just like that other model. You have so much area here to work with. Like, let's get cooking. So this is the gourmet setup, all LG appliances. It's blue. It's gray. Refrigerator, washer, dryer not included. So for cabinetry, we are looking at the 42 inch shakers. Pretty good overlay, almost a full overlay. Upgraded hardware. And these are an upgraded shaker. So clean on the edge. But this is the overlay right here. No soft close. Screwed on, stapled on drawers. Your LG cooktop, 36 inch. Cat 6, plug in your laptop. I'm not sure what I would plug in there. Now where are those cookies? Here's your pantry. And it goes around, wow. This one is gonna take about 10 Costco hauls in this inflationary environment. Wow, no cookies. Right behind we have a huge washroom. Two LEDs, fan, air ducts. Now we do have our dryer box for our vent and we have our hot cold. This is the drain for the uh, water softener. You have a clean out here if you did need to uh, get to plumbing. And we are cooking with gas. This is a pretty sweet hallway, guys. Let me show you. So you got this hallway coming in from the living, kind of like right behind the kitchen. And then what do we have here? Where are those cookies? Is this pantry number two? So make that 15 Costco hauls to fill up both of these pantries because you are going to need it. Now here's the garage. I wanted to see this one. So on this side, we have the three car setup. Again, that fourth car was the additional. It would have been a flex space. Three fluorescents in here. I like it. Got the water heater strapped up. Lift master garage door openers. Eight foot doors. Now I'm curious, where is that fourth car garage? Let's go find it. Welcome back. I'm pretty sure it's right around the corner. So what do we got here? This is the guest quarters. So you got this door here, you can just shut it. And then here is your bedroom. Feels large. I'm gonna guess about 14 by 14 in this suite. 10 foot ceilings, eight foot doors, one pre-wire. This room feels absolutely secluded from the other house, especially with this door here. So it's almost like the casita, but it is a suite, full suite, gorgeous. I like it too, I like the top. This works perfect for the bathroom. And then here's the third car. This would have been the flex area. I kind of like it just like this. I would have added a door right where that door was too to kind of seal up this whole suite. That's exactly what I'm thinking. There are, they are gonna put a uh, garage door opener up in here. Wow, you got some water here for a sink set up. So cool. The question is, do you fortify this door? All right, let's get back to reality. So pretty sweet. Now, right around the kitchen in the front, 
here's our game room. So at first I thought it was the primary window from the back, but it is the game room window. I think I was looking at the layout reversed. They did pull all flooring throughout in here. One single pre-wire above, two-tone paint. I wanna say it's, it's kind of a gray, so it almost looks like the on the rocks. You can see the contrast between the two. And what do we have behind door number three? Oh my goodness, where are those cookies? Make that 17 Costco hauls to fill all three of the pantries. I'm gonna call that a pantry, even though it's probably a great laundry area. My goodness, so much storage. This little kitchen has a lot going on. It's powerful. You got three storage closets all on each side. Back to our entry, we got two LEDs coming in. And behind door, number four, our coat closet. And I hope you're having an amazing day. It is beautiful here in Las Vegas. Now let's go to the left. Behind door number five, we've got storage. We've got stereo set up, lots of ethernet, lots of smurf tubing. Here's the primary suite, even bigger than the game room. Two modern windows, two oversized windows. They have added four canned lights in here and the pre-wire. It looks like a standard carpet. I don't mind. I usually go, try to go with the standard carpet and then what I'm gonna do later is rip it up and put in some LVP. I wanna get a puppy right now. I've been thinking about getting a Labrador and I'm just torn if I should just go to the rescue and rescue me a little mixed Labrador. I would love your feedback below. More LVP. Cultured marble, rectangle undermounts, and take a look. Your soaker with window. What a cool feature. I just love the style of these homes. I could definitely get used to a home like this. And you know it's empty, but when you put in all your stuff and make it your home, it comes alive. And look at that shower. Where is the LED for my shower? It's like a cave in here. Nice dark gray tiles. Got the soap niche, the bench. Did I tell you we have a rain shower equipped in this little beauty? Wow, talk about luxury. So yeah, 25,000 in incentive if you use their in-house lander and they are taking offers on these uh, quick move-ins as always. Probably get a pretty good deal on one actually. Love in the window, two LEDs. This could be bedroom number five or the office. Wow. Yeah, so in this neighborhood, if you look right behind, we got RVs parked back out here. We got covered garages, barn, sheds. I mean, the restrictions are much less on the HOA in a community like this. Right down the hall. I'm gonna go straight down. Here's bedroom number three. Another great size. All the square footage on all these rooms is great. Got one and ones down below for internet and cable. Walk in closet and then the model right across the street. This area is pretty sweet too. You have Durango. If you just go right up the street and take a right on Tropical, you got um, Sam's Club, Walmart, you got In-N-Out Burger. You kept really everything off of Centennial Center. So great shopping, great dining. I wanna admire this window. It changes the whole feel of the hallway. Now here's bedroom number four and what a bedroom it is. This one's probably the largest out of all of them with that walk-in closet too. Stunning. Nice size as well. 
So those are our bedrooms on this wing and our secondary bath. When you pull the LBP throughout, it's very dramatic. Here's your shower. This is the fi fiberglass tub and shower combo with the hardware upgrade. And did I show you the shoe rack? Look how cute that is. And the window. Just all the little features that tick my boxes on these single stories. So what do you guys think? The 3756 quick moving Summit Homes. So much room. Where do you start? So another quick move in, Corbett Ranch, Summit Homes, Northwest Las Vegas. If you'd like any more information, give me a call anytime. And if you like the video, hit like, hit subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.